How many guards are there down here? Oh, there's all zombies. Let's shoot the canister on his back. Hello everyone, my name is Mike and welcome to Dying Light. In the last part, we set off an explosion pattern on one of the towers for the GRE to see that there are survivors um, still in the city. But um, the GRE actually sent a fighter jet in and blew up the tower so that signal could not be seen anymore. So they're kind of like, like just, just getting rid of us now, they don't even care. Not even trying to save us. So um, our next mission is to unblock the radio jammers. And we're going to meet Jade now and see what the plan is. So let's jump off this roof. It's in the building below us. And also guys, I got a grappling hook. So now we can aim at a wall anywhere. Press L2 and we zoom right in. Like Batman. So it's pretty effective right there for getting around. It's got a short cooldown, but it's still really good for getting around. So I think Jade's in this building. Jade! Jade! Troy, this is Crane. Rise is taking Jade. He, he has her in some museum somewhere. Do you know what he's talking about? Museum, yes. Rise is using it as his headquarters. Crane, you can't go there. That place was built as a fortress. You'd be walking into a massive trap. No, no, no. It's not subtle enough to be a trap. There's got to be a way to sneak in, right? I mean, some way to surprise him? Let me think. Uh, Tariq, maybe? He's the museum's curator. He should know something about the dungeons hidden beneath the fortress. Great. I'll talk to him. All right. There's a building with a rooftop garden. You'll find Tariq there. And listen. If you get the chance, find yourself some new weapons. You'll need them. All right. So Ryze is taking Jade to a museum. She just told us to find some new weapons because we'll need them. I mean, we've got a few weapons in our inventory. Maybe we can craft a new one now. I know this sounds weird, like, but I like to use the um, bleed effect, the basic one. Because I feel like when you use fire and stuff, you, you burn yourself when you attack them. And it doesn't even proc that often. So I'm, I'm just happy with a basic bleed. So let's put that on. Um, let's try Let's try the pry bar. It's epic version, so I think it, that, that, that just means it lasts longer. It can repair it more. We've still got this machete as well. It's pretty good. And I'm, I'm um, seeing as we're uh, approaching... Where Rise is, it's like most likely to be a gunfight anyway. So we've still got the pistol and the police rifle, which is both pretty good for um, taking out people with guns. So now we can get around super quick with this grappling hook. You know, it, it does help getting up on top of rooftops. So you haven't got to find the, an alternate route onto a rooftop anymore. You can just straight up shoot yourself up there. All right, so we're approaching the museum right now. Let's get on the rooftop of it. Maybe there's, there's a way in through the roof. All right, so this is like a, actually a safe zone, so we can just walk in the door. Tariq, what do you want? We don't have anything here but a few scraps of food. Well, relax. Troy sent me. Troy, oh, thank God. I've been a nervous wreck since I found this kid. He's got nobody to look out for him. But I'm not so good with kids, you know. That's not why I'm here. But Troy promised she'd send someone. I need to get into the museum. The museum? But Troy told me someone would come to help. She promised. Okay, Tariq, you tell me how to get into the museum and maybe I can sort out your problem here, okay? Rise controls the museum. He would kill you on sight. Well, then I can't have him see me. Now, Troy said you used to be the curator, and that if anybody would know a way in, it'd be you, so how do I do it? Do you have scuba gear, perhaps? <sighs> no. Too bad. There's an entrance under the surface of Emerald Pond, but it would be a long swim under the water. You would most likely drown. It will most likely isn't definitely, so... I guess I'll give it a try. Alright, so I was mistaken right there. I thought we were going straight to the museum, but we're looking for help before we go. So, there's a way in underwater. Um, apparently, we'll drown if we take the swim. But, sounds like Crane wants to take that approach anyway. Alright guys, I think that's the uh, museum over there. Just like on the other side of this lake. So, we'll make our way across. I think the um, underwater passage might be around the front of it somewhere. So, let's jump down. 
Okay, so we're reaching the front of the um, this big cliff. And on the map, we've got a big orange circle. So, seeing as it's an underwater passage, it must be underneath here. If we look around, staying by yeah, you can see there's a little gap there. So we'll get our breath first, and now we'll go deep and go for it. Hopefully, we don't drown. Let's see how, how far this passage goes. I mean, the guy said that we'd need scuba gear to actually make it. But, uh, okay, this is getting quite deep now. Look at this. We're losing the bars running low now. We need to get to a surface as soon as possible. Nice, we found it. Little rest little rest spot. I think we need to carry on anyway. So let's um, maybe go down again. Right, I think we may actually have to come back to the surface and jump out here. Okay, we can jump over a little fence, and now there's more we have to swim through over here. <laughs> Alright, we made it. Alright, so we're going for like a stealth approach right now. I mean, stealth doesn't really work that well in this game. There's no stealth takedowns, there's no like, there's no, me there's no stealth mechanics in the game. It's just don't get spotted. Okay, so we're still not actually in the museum yet. We're still finding a way in. Yeah, I'm going to turn the f keep the flashlight switched off at the moment just to uh, reduce our chances of getting spotted. So we're still going through some kind of sewer system. I think the, uh, there's no surface here, so we need to just carry on. Actually, it's a good idea to turn the flashlight on now, isn't it? Um, okay, I need to find a way to go quickly. Go over this way. Oh god, we could drown soon. Are we swimming as fast as we can go? Because I'm getting a little bit nervous now on if we're going to survive or not. Yeah, this is what the guy meant, isn't it? By scuba gear. Shit. Okay, there's some stairs here. We may make it. Oh no, it's not even the surface. I think there might be a surface at the top of this. Oh, look at the bar. That was close. I think that's as close as you can get. I'm surprised I went the right way, to be honest. Right, back down again. There's a lot of dead bodies down here. Looks like there's some kind of piranhas as well, like fish eating the bodies. Okay, they're not piranhas, they're like just normal fish. So there's no stopping, we need to just keep going. So it seems like zombies as well do drown. They can't they can't breathe on the water. I think as long as we keep moving forward and keep finding new passageways to go through, we'll be okay. We should make it. Okay, it's getting a bit worrying again because there's no upper surface here. And the health the breath bar is getting pretty low. Oh shit. Just keep moving forward, just keep moving forward. Is it above us? Oh nice, it's above us. Ooh, okay, that's that's close. <laughs> God. My lungs. So we're just climbing up the top of this um like well now. This kind of reminds me of Uncharted a little bit, climbing out a well. Oh, seizures. Gotta love them seizures. Alright, let me just get my vision back before I jump down there. Not too sure what's going on. Troy. I hear you. I'm in. That was the easiest part of this. You realize that, right? You really suck at pep talks, Troy. Not my job, but good luck. Okay, so there's going to be um, this is probably going to be the most enemies we faced in this um, this museum. It is like the proper massive headquarters now of um, Rise and his men. We thought the garrison was bad. This is like ten times bigger. So I need to jump down into the water, I think, and then swim across. 
Oh, okay. Really? Did they spot me instantly? Need to get a gun out then if that's the case. Let's see what else. let's see what they're doing. Hey! <laughs> oh maybe it's because I've got a flashlight switched on. Hey look over there! Yeah, they're shooting me. Okay, that was quite noisy, so I'm expecting some reinforcements. I prefer the police rifle though over the military rifle, just because I think it's just a single shot, and it just, it just feels more accurate. I'm gonna keep, stick with the military and the police rifle. I'm gonna switch to the pistol when we run out of bullets. I think. We meet again. The last time we met, you took something of mine. Now I took something of yours. I don't negotiate with assholes, Rice. I get out of here with Jade, or I take your other hand too. Your choice. You cannot simply demand to have her crane. You must make a showing of effort first. Attack! Do it, boys. Do it. Go, go, go. Oh shit! All right, so this is just a massive fight now. It's kind of like the Matrix in the lobby. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Let's do this. Where are they coming from? I think this is glass, so you can probably go through that if you shoot it. Shooting grenades at me. What is that? Electricity. Whoa! Alright, so let's get these guys. Just keep shooting so there's no more bodies. They're throwing grenades at me. Oh shit. It's close. It's close. <laughs> I think we should switch out the grappling hook for the Molotov just so we can do some um, projectiles. I think we should just get in there, get some, because we can't get a good angle. I can do this all fucking day. Just gotta avoid these grenades. These guys are well hidden. Is that one? Yep. Whoa, how many bullets is this guy taken? Anyone else? Jade. She's so lonely without you. She's waiting for you. Come and get her. Okay, that door's locked. Alright, so this is like a big encounter right now. I'm trying to rescue Jade. I think, you know, we're a free runner, aren't we? So I think what the plan here is to just climb up. Actually, you know what? We've got a grappling hook. I'm, just, I'm an idiot for trying to do anything else. You're exhausted, you cannot use grappling hook. Okay. I'm exhausted. You think you're fast? There's a guy around this corner. Let's heal up. We've got plenty of med kits and I think we can make still loads more. So let's not stay away from healing. Oh shit. No. Not now. I bet you we get to like rise and we've got a knife to his throat. Then we have a seizure. <laughs> okay, I need this to wear off soon. I can't bloody see. It's wobbly as well. So we need to drop down, it seems. Go through a doorway somewhere. How do we get out of here? Okay, there's a door here. Just trying to keep cover. Hurry 
Figured we'd jump up here and get the high ground. I think there's still some guys down below. I'm sure I've seen one drop down from the roof. Okay, there's a lot of zombies out there. Holy shit. Um, is the window open? Yeah. Alright, let's... We don't want to fight too many of them, really. Let's just get the hatchet out. We repair it as well because it's pretty low. And now we'll just make a run across and we'll hit the ones that we have to. Just, just stay, stick to the wall and keep hacking. Okay, about stamina. It's not good. Jump up there, jump up there. Go, go, go. <laughs> Alright, switch back to the, um, the weapon. Okay, we heal, heal, heal. I'm up there. <laughs> Where am I going? I think we're going up this window. There's a guard right in front of us. Shit. Heal. That's a bit unfair. Oh. -ho. Okay, so we got through that. We're using a lot of health kits. Let's make a few more. That was just a panic mode right then. Getting through all there. How many guards are there down here? Oh, there's all zombies. Let's shoot the canister on his back. I mean, that's going to call more zombies, but I don't know if they're going to come because we are, like, in a, you know, a mission. In the open world, there'd more, be more zombies coming, but I don't know if there would be in this situation. We've got one more zombie somewhere, this guy. So we need to rescue Jade. Maybe she's in here. There she is. Jade! Oh shit. Oh shit, what have they done um, to you? Fine, Crane. To hear knock me over the head before he dumped me in here. Just... Give me a minute. Oh, I'll be right as rain. She looks pretty weak. Or pale. In fact, what little time you have, you owe to me. Thanks to your repair of my antennas, Crane, I've listened to every word any of you have said. How do you suppose I found you, Miss Aldemir? Or the good Dr. Camden? How do you think I broke the connection between the sectors? I am the director of this film. And now that I have Zera's research, the GRE will do as I command them, which renders the two of you useless. Tahir! You took offense, Crane, as I recall. Okay, so the sending gloves are infected in here. But look at you now. Dancing for our amusement. Just playing with us now. Let's get some melee weapons on these guys. We killed quite a few of them, I think, with the Molotov. Let's try another one. Actually. Let's craft some Molotovs. I just healed them by accident. I think Jade's inside there, actually. I just threw a Molotov at Jade. That wasn't clever. Let's kill this last one over here. Let the fire burn away. And we'll make our way inside. Let's go inside now. Run past the fire. Turn the flashlight on. Good job Jade can't take my damage. <laughs> well, I just told the chop the head off right there. Come on, Jade, let's get out of here. Alright, it's time to escape the museum now. Oh Jade, are Jade, are you hurt? Did they didn't bite you, did they? She looks infected. Fine. Just give me a second. Sweet little Jade is far from fine, Crane. She was beaten and infected hours ago. How noble of her to try and hide it from me. 
Biter got me on the leg. You didn't need to know. Once again, you find yourself with a choice, Craig. Your precious scorpion is about to turn. But so are you. Who will receive the antithesis? Who has a hope of living through this encounter? It's up to you now. Jade, here. You take this. No! Oh, come on. Listen, I've still got some in my system. You need this worse than I do. Crane, I just want you to promise me one thing. When the time comes, you're the one who takes me out. What? No, I... Promise me! Jade, I, I can't... Is this a choice then for the player or just Crane? I think that's just going to be for Crane, isn't it? Alright, so... We're in a worse state than she is, it seems. She's just run off. We can barely even stand. Crane, can you hear me? Jade, where are you? Jade? Why did she run away? I need you to hear me, Crane. I can hear you. Crane. Crane, can you hear me? Yes. Hello. This door's marked exit, so hopefully it's a quick exit out of here. Jade, where are you? Jade. What's going on? I know you wanted to try and save me. Not everybody would have offered that vial the way you did. But it's too late for that now. It's too late for me. I'm in some kind of direct dream state right now. This doesn't make much sense. We're tripping balls. For a while I blamed you for Amir's death. I wanted to kill you. But I realized it was time for Amir. It was time for him to go. No, not this again. Everybody's life is finite, Crane. You can't deny it. It's pointless. I think this is definitely the worst seizure we've had. <laughs> We get here, and eventually we die. Oh, shit. Oh. No. And there's nothing Not now. we can do to change that. They will kill us! Please. Not now. We're having plenty of flashbacks of what's happened. The only thing we can do is make what happens in between count what is this there's dr. Zer cream save this people Amir's life counted and now he's gone Rahim's life counted and now he's gone. If sacrificing my life means saving everyone in Haran, then that's what I want to do. Shit. No, not now. So pretty much everyone dies in this game, don't they? The only person that's still alive, I think, other than myself, is Brecken. Take that away from me, Crane. Let me save you. I think I'm going the right way. It's just crazy. When does this end? Been going on forever. Get the door open. Uh, God, please. 
Not now. Ugh. Going back to the start, really, aren't we? No. Damn it, no, don't let me do this. Is this real now? Is this what's actually happening? Huh. Jade, what was I? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. One of us has to live, Kyle. You just remember what you promised me. All of this, and still you had your choice made for you. Disappointing, Crane. You, 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 and you. Get in there and kill them. Jay's like a professional kickboxer before the outbreak, so she can definitely handle herself. Look at this shit. She's a beast. She's infected, had no weapons. I'm just annihilated four men. <laughs> My hero. Oh, and she's turned. Awesome. Right, Jade's gone then, so we need to kill her. Kill that son of a bitch. Okay, so everyone's gonna die now. It's just like if Jade dies, and you know, she was the most likable character in the game, and she's dead, so anyone else that dies now, you know, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Don't care. <laughs> Alright guys, we've got a boss fight against Tahir coming up right now. It's quite a long video I've just done right here, so um, we'll end it here, and we'll start the next video fighting against Tahir. See what happens next. See you next time, guys.